विदुर कॉलेज ग्रेट वन इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज राइटिंग एफ बट लेसन नाइन हेलो डियर चिल्ड्रन हाउ आर यू ऑल होप यू आर ऑल कीपिंग वेल Before coming to the lesson, I would like you all singing the alphabet song. Shall we sing together? Okay, let's start. One, two, three. A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. Now I know my A B C. Next time, won't you sing with me? Well done. Okay, now let's recall the lesson. We are going to look at some pictures. And say the letter. Shall we start? Okay. A is for apple. B is for boat. C is for caterpillar. D is for desk. E is for eight. F is for flamingo. G is for goose. Very good. H is for helicopter. I is for igloo. J is for jelly. K is for kettle. L is for Letter M is for moon. N is for nose. O is for octopus, and P is for parrot. Okay, well done. Okay, now, Sharon, can you tell me what is the next letter that comes after P? Shall we recall the alphabet letters? Okay, the first letter A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I. J K L M N O P and what is the next letter after P is Q yes it's Q Okay now children you're going to look at some pictures and pronounce these words picture number 1 what is the first picture the first picture is a queen shall we say it again queen picture number 2 the people are standing they are standing in a line So we can say it's a queue. What is it? Queue. Okay. Picture number three. What is it? It's a feather. Another name for feather is quill. Shall we say it again? Quill. Okay. Queen. Queue. Quill. Has the sound of qu at the beginning, qu at the beginning. Did you hear the sound? 
What is the sound you hear at the beginning? Kua. Okay. Now let's identify the capital letter and the simple letter. Okay, now we saw pictures for the letter Q. And there are two Qs. The first letter is capital Q. What is it? It's the capital Q. And you can see there is another Q. That is the simple Q. What is it? It's the simple Q. Can you show me the capital Q? Yes, it's the first letter. Can you show me the simple Q? Yes, it's the second letter. Very good. Okay, let's see how to write the letters. Take out your PWPs and the marker pens. Keep a dot on your board. Take a nice big circle onto your left hand side and stop at the starting point. You will get a nice big circle. The second step is just little inside the circle you are going to draw a short slanting line onto your right side. Shall we do that? Okay, this is the capital Q. Is your capital Q is same as the capital Q appears in the screen? Then it's very good. Now we are going to write the simple Q. Keep a dot on your board. Take a nice small curve onto your left hand side. Go up and come down in the same straight line. Go up a short slanting line and stop. This is the simple cue. Is your simple cue the same as the simple cue appears in the screen? Then it's good. Okay, now you are going to write the same letters in your transcription book. Shall we do that? Okay, now we have learned the letter Q. We are going to learn another new letter. Shall we recall the alphabet letters? Okay, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q. And what comes after the letter Q? The letter R. Okay. Shall we look at the pictures and pronounce these words? Okay, picture number one. Rose. Rose. Number two. Rope. Rope. Number three. Rug. Rug. Number four. Ribbon. Ribbon. Number five. Ring. Ring. Number six. Rabbit. Rabbit. Okay, when we pronounce these words, rose, rabbit, what sound we can hear at the beginning? The sound r. What is the sound? The sound r. Very good. Okay, our new letter is R. Let's identify the capital and the simple letters. This is the capital R. The big letter is the capital R. And the next letter is the simple R. Can you show me the capital R? Which one? The first letter. Can you show me the simple R? Which one? The second letter. Very good. 
Okay, now let's see how to write the letters. Take out your PWBs and the marker pens. Are you ready? Let's begin. Keep a dot on your board. Draw a straight line down and stop. Go back to the starting point and take a circle and join it to the straight line and stop. The third step is you're going to draw a slanting line down. Okay, from there, draw a slanting line down and stop. This is the capital R. Is your capital R is same as the capital R appears in the screen? Okay, then it's very good. We are going to do the simple R next. Keep a dot on your board, draw a straight line down, come up in the straight line, take a small curve onto your right side and stop. This is the simple R. Is your simple R is same as the simple R appears in the screen? Then it's very good. Okay, the same way you have to follow to write the letters in your transcription books. Okay, can you do that? Very good. Exercise 1. Write the starting letter for these pictures. Picture number 1. It's a cat. What is the starting letter? The starting letter is C. You can write the simple C in the box. Second picture. Fish. Starting letter F. Simple F in the box. Third picture. Jacket. Starting letter J. Simple J. For all the pictures, you are going to write the starting letter in the box. Can you do that? Well done. Okay children, let's remind what we have learned today. What did you learn today? Today, we learned the letter Q and R. Next, we saw pictures for the sound qu and r. Then we learned how to write the capital and the simple letters. Okay, that's all for today's lesson. Okay, now we have learned 13 letters in the English alphabet up to now. Okay, so can you tell me how many letters we have learned? We have learned 13 letters. Alright, now did you understand today's lesson children? Yes, I hope so. Alright, so thank you for joining with us. Until we meet again, goodbye.